friend Brucey has a business proposition for us. He going to pay me to pump him full of steroids and tell him how great his abs are? No, he can take care of that all by himself. Brucey is a major motorhead. He's going to send you emails about all the cars he wants, and you're going to get them for him. What are you going to do? Come on! I made the introduction! I'm the manager, man! Go check your emails, Nico. Let's hang out soon, okay? Hello. Hello. Uh, is Mikael home? No, he's out. Okay. Uh, should I wait outside? No, no, come in. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Sit down. Thank you. You want some tea? Sure. Mikhail doesn't let me use this anymore. Says it makes us look like barbarians. Uncivilized. Like immigrants. Oh, yeah? I know what you're thinking. It is a bit funny coming from him. <laughs> he did not used to be like this. When we were young, at home, he was beautiful. He was happy. He made me happy. But um, then something changed years ago. I never quite knew what it was. So many years I wondered what it was or what was wrong with me that I did not see it in him. Or I changed him. Life is complicated. I, I never thought I'd live like this. No? When the war came, I did bad things. And after the war, I thought nothing of doing bad things. I killed people, smuggled people, sold people. And you don't worry about your soul? <sighs> after you walk into a village and you see 50 children all sitting neatly in a row against the church wall, each with their throats cut and their hands chopped off, you realize that the creature that could do this doesn't have a soul. God is very complicated. You mustn't give up hope. Huh. Well, I don't know about that. Привет, Лена. Привет, Ма. What is that? Ah. Uh, I tell you one thing, and you ignore me. Uh, you stupid uh, bitch. Uh, <laughs> Nico Bellic, baby. Good to see you. Hey, you too. <sighs> what did you want? Oh, I want you to teach people to listen to you me. You want him to get us the money? Fuck the money. Mikhail, please calm down. We're already in a lot of trouble. I don't know if I can smooth things over with Petrovic. Fuck him and fuck you. Who are you, my daddy? Get the fuck out of my house. Mikhail! Get out! So, what do you want? This prig who owes me money owns a garage in Chase Point. I want you to pick up a truck and take it to him. Call me when you get to the truck. It's in Schuttler on Montauk Avenue. Go. Get out of here.
this to get ugly, man. Get off me now, you fucking shit! Hey, These are hot! Come and eat them! Mr. Faustin, I have the truck. Drive it over to the garage on the corner of Guantanamo and Windmill, park up inside. Sure. What am I delivering? When it's inside, think of the explosives. Should blow up good. Maybe you'll be careful on the drive over. It's pretty volatile stuff. Explosive? What the fuck? Calculating route. Turn right. <laughs> Roman, we should go and get drunk together. Roman, I'm nervous enough about driving a truck full of explosives around the city for Mikhail Faust. He's out of control. Anyway, I'm sorry, but if I get drunk with you and then drive this thing, I'll definitely blow myself up. I'll catch you later, cousin. Get out of 
of my way. Kenny, Kenny, look the garage. Oh, bless your heart. I've blown the place up, but don't pull that shit on me again. Maybe I don't want to drive around while sitting on an atom bomb. I thought you were the ice cold killer. I thought nothing scares you, man, pussy. Hasn't anyone got any balls? You and Dimitri, you'd be nothing without me. Nothing. This is how you treat me? Dimitri. Hey. Sit down. What's the problem? What do you think? Mikael, Mr. Faust. Uh-huh. You're given a choice. Kill your best friend or die. What do you do? And there is no way out? Not now. Not after you killed Petrovic's son. You don't have any family. You could run. Wherever you go, people will find you if they want to badly enough. And for this, they want blood. But you and Mikhail, you have so much history. Sure. Well, I killed the boy. So they want me to? No. I told them you were a hired gun. And they said, as long as you were the one to kill him, you'd be spared. <laughs> so that's the way it is. 
Yes, that's the way it is. He'll be leaving his house in a little while and heading for the club. Do what you have to do. You know, if there's one thing I've learned, it's that we must obey the rules of the game. We can pick the game, Nico Belik, but we cannot change the rules. See you later. Nico! Nico Bellic! You and Dimitri are taking over, no? This is not about taking over! You brought this on yourself! You pushed things too far! You would be dead if it wasn't for me. That is what Dimitri wanted when you killed Vlad. Dimitri... My brother. You see this? This statue says we are brothers for life. And now he betrays me. You didn't give him a choice. <laughs> you should have been calm. No one, not Dimitri, not anyone tells me to come. You think Dimitri would have survived prison without me? He'd just be some prison queen! Had I not been there, meet for some gin monkey! I am not dead yet. Some are still loyal to me. Guards! I've got something special! You you are nothing but a Give this up! Guy's going the to strong die. survive! And we People! Help me! Okay. It's all last in
Faustin is dead. You did a good thing. A hard thing. But a good thing. Hopefully this will mean peace with Petrovic. Hey. Uh. Hello. I'm busy. I said hello. Ow! Motherfucker! Is your boss around? What'd you do that for? Is your boss around? Yeah, he's around. Brucey, some fucking Polak asshole for you. Pleasure to meet you too. He's not a Polak. He's a gentleman. Still a fucking asshole. Sorry, Nikki, man. How's things? Okay. Sweet. <laughs> I got you, man. I'm big, but I'm also fast. Wake up, boy! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Well, can you show me that again? <laughs> oh! Ah! Oh! Enough, man! Enough! Oh! oh. <laughs> Fuck me, be man. All right, huh? Ooh, that's some Red Army shit. Serious. You gotta show me that one. I'm all about power. Come on, touch my backs, man. No, thank you. Rock hard. I bench 450. I'm a. Uh, no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, no shit. What are you doing here, man? Well, Roman said maybe you needed some help and we need some money real bad. Shit, my bad. Yeah, of course. Love that guy. Love him. I mean, I am no chubby chaser, but if I was and a queer, that guy would be in trouble. You know what I'll I mean? I'll let them know. <laughs> hey, I'm shitting with you. Brucey likes pussy. Remember that, all right? Okay. All right now, Nikki, listen up. I know you guys need money, bad. Yeah. This ain't a nice job. Not exactly mom and pop shit. No problem, as long as the pay is good. Sometimes people fuck other people over, okay? And the people that fuck other people need to get fucked with, especially people that go into hiding before they can get on the stand and put a lot of guys inside for a lot of time. What? I need you to whack some people, only they're in hiding. How do I find them? Man, you're cold! You didn't even blink! Love that! I fucking love that! You gotta steal a police car. Get on the computer, give me a call. They're easy to hack. Not really. All right, Brucey. I'll give you a call. Ice cold, man! Ice cold! Woo. Hello. You're through to the Liberty City Emergency Services. Please use your... Hello, this is the LCPD. Where would you like us to send an officer? Boa Bo. An LCPD peacekeeper will be there as soon as possible, sir. Responding to a call from this location. You're getting robbed. Stay calm. Cover Don't me. You put your hands on you me. I hope you got insurance.
I'm here. I have a computer. You're a badass, man. I love it. Now, this cat's name's Lyle Revis. Type it into the computer, and you should get some known whereabouts and shit. I take them out myself, but when people see me coming, they fucking run, man. I know what I'm saying? Cats don't want to mess with someone packing 24-inch guns like mine, baby. Yeah! I'll track down this Revis. Cold, man. I'm feeling chills down the phone. Call me when it's done, bro. Lyle Revis, I got a message from Brucey for you. Brucey? I thought he was fucking joking. Shit! friend. Don't worry about Rivas anymore. Lethal, man. A lot of people are gonna be very grateful that certain people who fucked with them can't say things to other people or fuck with anyone anymore. If you get me. I get the money you're paying. You're all about the cabbage. I mean, the lettuce, the lettuce. Ice cold, man. I love it. There'll be some more work when you need it.
Dimitri, you got my money? I have it. Meet me at the warehouse on Maganet in downtown Broker. Come along. I only pissed off one. He's dead. I'm going to meet Dimitri to collect on the hit. Yo, Nico, you better watch your back, you know. Me know you're wicked, but them boy them are some dog ass, you know. I'm not afraid of him. Yeah, but I can't see. The heart can't leave, but you know. They are come with you. Where's the place? A warehouse on Mohane. I know the one. You see around the back. Shot by his, huh? You don't know. My avid scene star. Hey, Nico. Glad you can make it. Yes. You got the money? Sure. But I just wanted to say how grateful me and my bosses are for what you did. Good. Yes. And I just wanted to check something with you. Okay. You are Nico Bellic, correct? What is this? And you used to work the coast in the Mediterranean, smuggling people into Italy. I don't know what you're talking about. But you messed up and left a lot of bad debt. You left a good friend of mine out of pocket, big time. Hello, Nico. Hello, Mr. Bulgarin. Ross. Where is our money? I don't know. I didn't rob you. Really? We were busted a mile off the coast. I had to swim for my life. I don't know what happened. I nearly drowned. Huh. My heart was bleeding. I did my best. I didn't fuck up. Well, there you are. Ah! Ah! Make her go back to the cafe, see? Don't 
Drop the gun! LCPD! Everything crashed back there. Run on all over the place. Lose them! I'm trying to fucking lose them. You won't fuck up the game back there. What went wrong? I don't fucking know. I can't think about it now. I need to shake these fucking pigs. But I'm just a whole man down. You're right, you're standing on Nico. Yo, you lose Babylon, man. Far back at the cafe you now. Yeah, I need to block up some more. Told you Dimitri was a snake in the grass. I didn't know that Mr. Baldwin was here in Liberty City. If I could have killed them all then and there. Just chill, Nico, man. One at a time. One, one coca filled basket, see? We find out where Dimitri is, then BAM! We take the rest of them out. Just keep your head down until then. Fucking Dimitri. Made me kill Faust and then he sell me down the river. Just call Nico, the boy is a general, you know what I'm He's gonna make his own downfall. The higher the monkey climb, the more he makes spores and bat wall, you see it? I will bring Dimitri down myself. I promise you this. I'm gonna speak to Batman. You keep on alone, call your woman and get out of this place. Hey, thanks for your help, Jacob. One love, my brother. Roman! Roman, where are you? In here! I'm stuck! Let me out! Shit, man! <sighs> what are you doing in there? I got scared. People started calling the house and hanging up. You weren't answering your phone! What happened? We've got a big problem. Dimitri was not a man of his word. So we're dead? More or less. Everything was fine before yes, you. Yes, yes. Fine, and now this! Thank you! Thanks a lot! It's Vanny. 
Не видно. What's done is done. Yes. But there's a bigger problem. What? That guy I owed money to, Bulgarin. Yes, the guy in Europe, who lives by the Adriatic. Yeah, yeah, he's here now. Great. I'm sorry. I've ruined your life. No, don't be like that. We, we can find a way out of this. Bunch of idiot Russians. I will kill every one of them. No, that's exactly what you won't do. We don't have time for revenge. We can't afford it. What can we afford? Uh, we can lay low and start over. Please. Uh, come on. Let's go back to the apartment. We can pick up our stuff, and then get out of here. I'll call Mallory. She might have somewhere we can hide out. Hey, beautiful! Um, listen, me and Nico are in a bit of trouble. Um, need to get out of broker a few days. Any of your cousins have a place we could use out in Bohem? Oh, you're an angel. Beautiful and kind. I love you. We'll see you there. <sighs> Maybe things are not so bad. This I did not expect. I was thinking about getting out of the cab business. Last night I had a dream. Really? Yes. You and I had a place of our own. A place where people come to eat and relax. Classy place. None of this fast food diner bullshit. We own a real restaurant. Tavern is a place of distinction, you know? I can't see myself settling down. Not now, but in the dream, you've met the right woman. She's beautiful. You're like my Mallory. In the dream, Mallory and me... What the fuck? Holy fuck, it's fucking burning! The whole place! I've got to go in! I've got to get something! Leave it, cousin. This place is gone. They burnt it! They fucking burnt it, Nico! Do you know how long it took me to get a place of my own? You got off the boat and I was here for you! I know you were. I got here and I had nothing! Nobody! I worked my way up from the fucking dirt! It's on fire! Fuck! I've got nothing left! Not my home, not my business, nothing! They took it all! I'm sorry, Roman. I'm really sorry, but we have to go. We'll meet Mallory and Bohan. You still have her. And you! For all the good you've done me! Do you know how long it took me to get set up here? You don't, because it was easy for you. You had it all from day one. It took me months to get some cash together. Finally, I bought a cab, and then another. Then I got the depot. I slept under my desk at that place for over a year. Then I got the apartment. The apartment you thought was so shitty. Well, it doesn't matter. And now it's gone, along with everything else. I said I'm sorry. You have a lot to apologize for. Since you got here, I've had my computer smashed, I've been beaten up, I was kidnapped, and then shot in the stomach! My apartment got burned down and so did my business! Things have been going so great! Just great since you showed up! You remember that time when we went to the bar back home and found it raised to the ground? Just a pile of rubble. Everything smashed. Except for that one bottle of vodka. Yeah, we sat down and finished it off there and then. Wait, wait, I don't want to talk about back home. We're here in America now. And I should be thinking about my life here. My life, which is ruined. Just drive, shut up, drive. <laughs> hey, beautiful. What's up? No, what do you mean? I haven't been crying since my allergies. Nicole's wearing this new cologne. Yeah, trying to impress Michelle or something. They're coming to your cousins. Are you there? Great. See you in a bit, Bill. My dream? It was just that. A dream. 
I can't have the tavern now. I have nothing to buy it with. I have, I have nothing. I told you. You still have Mallory. But I wanted to really have her. I wanted to marry her. You can still do that. I had bought her a ring. That is what I wanted to show you. It was a beautiful ring. It was with you. Now I have nothing. Come on. Roman, pull yourself together. You've been here before. Positive, mental attitude. Come on. Mm. At least they want me there, and not you. <sighs> I do not think it will be much difference to them, Nico. One dead Belik will give them a little bit of happiness while they wait for next. I do not care, though. We are in this situation. We must deal with it. Bring on Bohan! Okay! Beginning of our new lives. Again. <sighs> Not so bad. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we'll be impressing women with our wonderful hot tub, but uh, this looks okay. Yes, great. Come on, what's what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Where should I start? All right, I'll start with you. What's wrong with you? Fifteen minutes ago, you were cowering in fear because you didn't know what was going to happen. Now, you know everything is shit, and you're going to be killed, and you're all cheerful. I don't get it. I guess I'm an optimist. An idiot, not an optimist. I was bored of Broker anyway! I'm glad you turned up and made some Russian killers burn down my oh. home and business. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Nico. Thanks a bunch. Is that better? March! Oh, thank God you're okay. Mwah. Mwah. Both of you. We're fucked. We're broke and on the run. No, I'm from up here, Nico. I know a bunch of people who might be able to help out. Why don't you come and meet me at the community center later on? I gotta go to work. Bye, Poppy. And have a shower. You smell a little, um, mature. So, I guess we start again. Sure. I'm going out. I need the car, man. Easy, easy. You're messing up my vines, son. Ease Come on, out, out of the way. I ain't gonna play with your ass. Yo, yo, yo! Please make a U-turn where safe. In 100 yards, turn left.
please make a U-turn where safe. In 200 yards, turn left. body with the others in the warehouse. Mr. Bulgarin and I were very disappointed. I was loyal to you, Dimitri. Why did you turn on me? You think I could survive in a death pit of a city like this by aligning myself with a bottom feeder like you? You who has so many enemies! You robbed Bulgarin, you killed Mikhail, you know no more of loyalty than I do. You know why I killed Faustin? It was not my choice. I will find you, Nico. I have burnt you and your cousin out of Home Beach. I will smoke you out of any other hiding place you have in this city. See you soon, Nico. Right. Hey, Brucey. Nico! One second. Sorry. <clears throat> Why didn't you tell me it was Nico? Why? Man, women. Man. Women. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wah! Yeah! Man, I'm ready for you, Nikki. I'm ready. I'm ready for fucking anything. Yeah! Wah! 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 Whoa! Whoa! Are you all right? You seem a little tense. Yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm just juicing. Makes me a little pent up. Juicing? Yeah. Bull shark testosterone, amigo. Ordered online from Chile. Makes you feel really male. Hey, be careful, man. I heard that stuff does funny things to your balls. Hey, do I look like I got funny balls to you? <laughs> I haven't considered it. Uh, you sent me a message. What do you want? Want help? I'm losing the plot here. Pause. No. <laughs> Shitting, man. Now look, you did really good with that thing. A lot of people are very grateful. Now listen, that guy Lyle had a car worth stealing. Can you get it? He left it in an alleyway off of Yorktown Avenue in Steinway. If you pay like last time, no problem. Yeah, of course. Any risks? Nah. Easy as can be. Yeah. <sighs> okay, uh, I'll just go take care of it then. Yeah! <sighs> Bye.
No risks, Brucey? Maybe this juicing is fucking with your head. He trying to take Lyle's bride. That's Lyle's bride. Brucey asked me to bring this by. You're lucky it looks as good as it does. The only thing Brucey thinks is good looking is himself in the mirror. Thanks. Deep, baby. 